Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to show you guys how to do the Mercy Super Jump, which if you guys don't know what that is, is basically a way for Mercy to propel herself into the air without having a teammate be physically in the air for her to fly to. To give you a quick demonstration of how this could be useful in practice, so this clip was taken from my Smurf games on stream yesterday. Um, notice how I'm being chased by like a Tracer and a Reaper and Lucio. Well, I'm able to make the most use out of high ground by using this trick, so it allows me to switch back and forth between high ground and low ground, and that actually allows me to dodge a lot of their attacks. So it's actually really useful for keeping yourself alive as Mercy. Another example is this clip here where my team is pretty much all dead and I am being chased by this Mei. Now to survive, I don't have anyone else to fly to so the only way to go is upwards. So what I do, um, as you see here Mei is trying to freeze me, what I do is I use Orisa to propel myself upwards. Unfortunately I still die but I hope you guys can see how useful this trick is, especially when you don't have teammates to fly to. Now I'm sure some of you, or a lot of you might already know this trick, it's not new. Um, a few Mercy players have already shown this um, around on Twitter, like Vale as well as Animatic in some of the videos, but I'm surprised because when I streamed a lot of you guys didn't know what this was and you were asking me how to do it, so I thought I'd just make this tutorial to show you guys how to do it. And it's actually really simple. Okay, so the first thing that you want to make sure, um, and I don't know if this works on um, console, but please let me know if it does. Or how it works. Anyway, the first thing you want to make sure you're not doing is to go into your options and making sure that your control key or whatever your bound whatever your key binding for your crouch is isn't bound to anything else. So just make sure you go through and make sure um, control is solely for crouching, which I have done here. Crouch, right? Now the key to doing this trick is to actually guardian angel while you're crouching, but you're not meant to press them one after the other because if you do that you're going to find yourself flying horizontally, which is where I think a lot of you guys are getting this trick wrong. Um, you're actually supposed to press them at the same time so that it gives you sort of a dip in your movement. So let me show you guys. When I press them, when I press control and shift um, at the same time, notice how I'm like gliding along the ground. Now that's actually a very useful trick when you're trying to get into doorways or something because often if you just press shift you might find that you're stuck on the door which is bad and you can get killed so it's actually a good way to just glide along the ground and I don't know if it's faster but it seems a little faster to me. Now to do the trick all you have to do is at the end of your trajectory just press spacebar like that and you'll find yourself um, flying upwards. Now this trick is so useful when you're trying to like dodge Winstons or Genjis or anyone that's trying to flank you because you can get high ground and you can propel yourself onto like higher platforms and stuff like that where they can't reach you. But one thing to be aware of with this trick is that you can be killed by snipers quite easily. So make sure that you're aware of what sort of heroes the enemy team is running because you don't want to be using this all the time and finding yourself um, being sniped out of the air, which I which I notice happens to me quite a lot um, when I'm trying to use this trick um, in situations where it's not needed. I mean, when you're versing snipers and stuff, it's best to just um, hang around corners and walls and making sure that you're not peeking too much um, because if you're versing a good widow or something and you do this trick, the chances are you're going to be sniped out of the air. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video somewhat useful and let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of this trick and as always, thanks for your time and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. If